my son. Oh, that. It sounds like they just, it sounds like that's replacing the physical therapy. Is it just said that's a program that they want me to do exercises? That's the same thing. I bet it, man. Everybody's like, you need to come back strong. All right. It I better is. be dunking. You better be dunking. Yes. <laughs> Look, mom, this is this the only thing that's scary. Me. It looks so weird because if you can see right here, it's indented. This is like concave. If, if I bring it back, you can see it's like that's going in. Oh, my God. Like, around here. Yeah. Looks so weird. Like, look, if you come on this side, look at it. So, hey, y'all. Stop by to say hey, hey. I started this off talking to my son, y'all. As y'all know, my son is in the Navy. My son hurt his leg last month, right before Christmas. He came home for the holiday, went back, and he just had his surgery. But anyway, he was just showing me, um, you know, what the leg is looking like now. He's been in a lot of pain. And so, yeah like it's crazy so anyway y'all i'm laying here like i feel like i'm stuck you know i'm trying to get my groove back or whatever you know i'm ready to start back recording on both of my channels on my vlog channel and my beauty channel and i'm sitting here waiting because this stupid basement floods every time um we wash so i'm waiting on the plumber to come they were supposed to be here between 10 and 11 and it's like 12 o'clock now so i'm like pissed off because i was so ready i was set up ready to record for my vlog channel and they taking all day so anyway i'm just sitting here laying around waiting on them um i got my setup and stuff ready in there because i really don't have my setup like i did at the old house my beauty room none of that is even set up it's still empty in there but anyway i'm laying here but i did want to click in because like i said i want to start back vlogging and so right now Huh? Oh, the plumber is now here while I'm vlogging. Yeah, did I have a package? Mm -hmm. So anyway, I'm waiting on a couple of packages to come through today. Um, dang, why they leave? They gonna leave my door open. Let me check the mail. Ooh, ooh. It's cold. I fear I'm tripping. Oh, trouble. Look, terrible. Nothing. <laughs> so anyway, yeah. Uh. Ooh, I'm waiting on a couple of packages because I want to add it to the video that I'm um, here ready to upload today. Oh yeah, it's cold out there. Go down here and talk to the plumber man. I'll see y'all when I turn this camera back on. So let me show y'all what I gotta put up with. Princess. Yes. Did you see me? Really, princess? I'm just chilling. In the cabinet? Yeah. That's the best way to start. Start what? In the cabinet. So that's what I got to put up with. Either she bouncing that whole basketball in my house, or she doing stuff like that. I'm trying to get things together. You know, like, this is my first time really trying to do home decor. Like, I've always had furniture. I always bought brand new furniture, but I've never, you know, like, decorated, you know, with home decor. I never put uh, anything on the walls or anything like that. I never even had panels up to my window. For one, I couldn't do it. I didn't have nobody else to do it. I bought some panels last year at the old house or year before last. I don't know that I had one of my husband put up. Never did get put up and i spent a lot of money on those panels so but anyway i got somebody to do it for me now put my panels up so this is gonna be the first time that i will have curtains up to my uh windows y'all i'm so excited can't wait to get things together now i know it's not gonna come together like i wanted to like right now because like i don't have all that kind of money so it's gonna take time so that's why i'm just going through buying little different pieces and stuff like that so i can get my home the way i want it to and with my babies being older and one gone which three should be gone i don't know about the house they graduated and still at home but anyway that's a whole other story um I never really had a problem with my children tearing up my furniture. They were hard on my blinds. Oh my God, it just looked like, I don't even want to tell y'all what they look like because I don't want nobody to get offended. But yeah, I don't play games about the blinds, but I didn't want to take no chances with them either, even though they are older. So that's why I got these wood blinds. So, um, and they are coilless. So you just have to push it up like this, like that and pull down. So, yeah, that's why I got those blinds so they won't look so raggedy, y'all. 
but anyway yeah like i was telling y'all earlier i'm gonna try to go ahead and edit some videos because like i said i, I am excited about being back vlogging so yeah y'all oh <sighs> so finally he left he fixed the plumbing the basement should no longer flood when i use my washing machine like it's a sad shame that you can't even enjoy your home it's always something but anyway in between time in the meantime i got my package so anyway i'm gonna do my uh, home decor haul i'm gonna do this vlog style i end up going to home goods which y'all already saw that video i'm sure but anyway i went to get some little knickknacks for the house it ain't everything that i need for the house it's just the store but anyway the first thing is this cute 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 vase so 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 cute and i got this from at home it's cute and this is 35 dollars but i got it on sale for 14.99 that I got from at home was this base here. Kind of look like a, a, a purse, does it? Look like a purse. I got this from at home as well. This was for $26, but I ended up getting it for $12.99. Then the next thing I got is this hourglass. The sand inside of it is gray. And this is for uh, 60 minutes. And I paid $14.99 for this. And this next item that I purchased is this sign that says dream. I hope it don't make my room look a little childish, but it really did catch my eye. I purchased this for $24 at, at home as well to put over my bed. I can't wait to see how it's going to look. I feel like it's going to match my room decor pretty well. Yes, mirror, mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest of them all? Yes, I purchased these two mirrors here to go right above my nightstands, which is mirror as well. I just think mirror uh, opens up your room, make it feel airy. I purchased two of these. This is the second one. And these were for $49.99 from at home. I can't wait to put them on my wall. I know it's going to be beautiful. Next up are my pillows that I currently have on my bed. Those two pillows there, the gray and white looking pillows, I got those from Target as well as a throw to match it. And I got this pillow from Bob's Furniture, the place that I purchased my um, living room set at, and it was $19. And this pillow here, came from target as well now i do have other pillows that i will be incorporating on my bed but right now um i don't have them to show you but i will show you a little bit later up next are my purchases from home goods starting with this box i got this box here from home goods purchases to set on my vanity in my bedroom and this was 19.99 so i got that and since this next beauty is a masterpiece in my mind when i saw this i knew i had to bring her home with me i just knew it would make a great statement piece in my bedroom this here was 99 dollars from home goods i had to get it it's going to sit right over my vanity in my room but as i think about it and go on i think this will make a great statement piece in my dining room and i got this to set my perfumes on. I got this from Home Good as well. I paid $39.99 for this. I really love this. This is so, so, so cute. The only downfall about having mirrored furniture is that all the fingerprints that's on it. But yeah, I got fingerprints all on that already. And then I got this candle holder here. I got this from Home Good as well. And it was $16.99. This is how this is looking. I got this to sit on my vanity in my room. It's really cute. And this vase here, 
I purchased by mistake. I really wasn't meaning to buy it, but it just ended up in my cart. Like, you know, I was just looking at stuff, but this was $12.99. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it because like I said, I had no intentions on really purchasing this. And I also got me a napkin holder also to use on my bedside. And this was $12.99. $12.99. $12 and then my next purchase, I got this globe because eventually my um, pop of color is going to be blue. You know, I'm doing blue silvers and grays and some whites. So um, that's why I got this in blue. And I got this from Home Goods as well. And this was $29.99. So I got my globe. And yes, here is another beauty that set my entryway off this beautiful mirror. I purchased from Home Good for $79.99. When you walk into my entryway, it speaks glam all day long. I love it. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot to show y'all something. One more purchase that I have made on yesterday. Where is it? So anyway, yeah, I forgot about the per this purchase here. Princess. Uh, a lamp for her nightstand in her room now princess is um her bed will be here on february the 9th her bed is this color as well it also has the tufting on it with the little diamond things on it whatever you want to call it but it's shaped differently and of course it's a twin bed so um yeah i got this lamp here to go on her nice stand and she also picked up some pillows i forgot to show y'all we got them the same day we got that and um it's this old crazy thing here oh is it messed up now but anyway she wanted this pillow which it does not look like the same pink that i'm going for in her room it's a little dark dark but I guess I can make it work but this is the pink that I was going with in her room for as uh color wise so I use pink gray and white in her room because she just loves pink I tried to get her to change it but she wouldn't so we she's already pink so we're just going to add the gray to it my vlog style home decor haul and I also finally got my blind for my bedroom as y'all remember I did my vlog on my blind yeah but I never did get a chance to get the ones for my room because I had ran out of money so um that was that okay Andre everything that i'm ordering is taking like forever to come like i don't even know what i order anymore just like my my nice thing is gonna come at the end of february i canceled the order for um the table the savoy table because they said it won't come until the end of march like i don't want to wait that long like y'all already overcharge us so i don't want to wait that long to get my stuff so i canceled that order and so now i need uh tables because I canceled the order which I shouldn't have paid $900 anyway for a table at the time I had the money but anyway I I feel like my furniture gonna be here before um that like I wanted that table so bad y'all just don't know but anyway I don't even care I'll end up I'm sure I'll find something just open this box <laughs> I'm sure I'll find something just as beautiful, which means I can go ahead and change this little ugly bulb out like I wanted to. The one that, uh, the, the little chandelier light, whatever you want to call it, was $200, so I can just probably do that. And um, maybe when I get my income tax, then I'll reorder from um, Z Gallery. But this time, I'm going to see if I can go in the store and see. I really don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just hoping and wishing to see if I can just order, you know, from the store because I have a Z Gallery store here. And so, and see if I can get it that way but anyway enough talking so what I got oh princess I know what this is what? this is your comforter for your brand new bed that's what that is what is this oh snap it snap and okay can I get my stuff and this is my dish rack y'all why i paid 70 dollars for a dish rack i don't know i always do that i don't know why i do stuff so anyway yeah this is my dish rack 
let me show y'all what it's looking like so this is the dish rack yeah look at it it is so cute because y'all i needed this i really needed this because the way my kitchen is gonna be set up it's all chrome and white and black and so it got stainless steel appliances once everything is in there so i had to get this this is a stainless steel dish rack i'm so excited about this look how beautiful this is So I'm gonna go get a wine glass because that attachment that you see on there is a wine glass holder. Dang, why well, had to get by these big old country wine glass? And the reason I ordered that, like I told y'all, because of the color, it was chrome, and I do drink wine, and you know, wine glasses do break easily. So yeah, this is the setup of my new dish rack. Oh my God, I love it, I love it. It is so freaking cool. It's gonna look so beautiful. In my kitchen, yay. That's the old one. That was from my old house, but I had to bring it. I needed something to use to hold my um, dishes. But anyway, this will be my new setup. I, and as y'all can see, I got my wine. I told y'all drink that wine, baby. Yes, that's why I needed this because I got tired of my uh, wine glasses breaking and um, I had to try to get so that was more thick because wine glasses, some of them are really cheap and fragile. So I ended up having to get some more. So, but anyway, this is my setup and I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Hey. So anyway, yeah, that's what um I got going on right now. Yes. Uh, what I call you for? Oh, you don't got another box you can find. Mm -hmm. Mama, huh? I know how to make bacon. You just made some bacon? Mm-hmm. You didn't make that. Uh-huh. Give me a piece. How you, who made it? Mm -hmm. Oh, you made it microwave? By yourself? Mm-hmm. I'm just going to they made it, but I'm going to make it right now because I'm hungry. You hungry again? Mm-hmm. Girl, don't buy. You eat too much. So, I'm going down here and check the basement. Oh, wow. Fixed it. So, look like he did fix it. The water has gone down. So anyway, we needed him to come and do that. We're getting ready to paint the basement and stuff. So that's why we needed him to get on out here because we couldn't do what we had to do because if we got down there fixing up on the basin and painting and it kept flooding it would have messed up so we already got our uh buckets of paint man this paint was so expensive like 120 for one and 150 for the other like it's crazy when you're trying to improve your home it is very expensive so anyway yeah y'all that's all i got going on right now i'm not going outside today because i'm excited about uh back then vlogging so i'm gonna spend the rest of this day editing videos yes and just wait around for my furniture hi bubba say hi to my son hi son Sup. but anyway <laughs> <laughs> anyway y'all that's what i'm about to do i'm gonna edit some videos so on that note y'all until next time until the next video bye bye